good steak. Ready. Do you want anything else on it or just the salt? Maybe. Uh, Serve. Thank you, my love. <laughs> That's when you sneaks last night. Nike Prestos. They were so cheap. Oh my goodness. I wore them last night for cardio and they were so comfy because I actually forgot to bring like a cardio sneaker. I just brought my Converse to train in and then just um, like my other sneakers that obviously I'm not going to train in those ones. So Nike Outlet was right next door. I got these for like what were they like $49 or something? These are so comfy. Oh my goodness. They made my cardio feel like I was walking on a cloud. Mark got a pair too. And then he went back to a different one today. Did you get the other shoes today? Yeah. The white ones? Yeah, I'll Cool. Yo. How cute is this orange color? Love it. Looks like so cute. This is the molded top that I was talking about, how it just kind of molds to the sides. I just really love it. So we're going to do a quick check-in um, before I eat my next meal. I'm actually lighter right now than my morning check-in weight fasted this morning, which is a good sign because that means that I'll probably just continue to flush water throughout the day. And then hopefully we'll wake up with a new load tomorrow after all the carbs and we'll go from there and see. Check-ins. What do you think? Are you trying to flex your house too? I don't have house. <laughs> so. Oh my gosh. I don't know what it is here. Usually I feel like I look best fasted, but I definitely, what's this camera? I definitely feel like here I look so much better midday. Like my check-in right now looked really, really good. I'm happy about. I mean, in Vegas, when I wake up, I'm like dry and crispy. And here when I wake up, I feel like I have a film of water until I start drinking water and moving around. This is the desert, so it's dry here. It's a yeah, lot it's more different. moisture in the air, which I find it to be a lot more comfortable. Um, but it's we just nice need to, skin. yeah, we just need to figure that out to acclimate. Um, you know, we just needed a few days to be here for you to acclimate. Yes. But it's good because you're drinking a lot of water. The food is responding very, very well, and. Um, the strengths of Jennifer Doria are really her shape, symmetry, roundness, and you guys saw the condition last year, so the hybrid of those two. Why do you do stuff like that? You're so extra. We're just different. You're so nice, and I'm so like, <laughs> it's time to battle. Too much. Look what time it is. Four, four, four. Time for you to eat. Time to eat. Show them. So Pegasus for running, because you guys know that I'm doing running and cardio and boxing now. I got them for so cheap at the outlets. Great. And it's new, my favorite color. Great. Neutral. We're going to train one of our last heavier leg days today. Today we're going to go hard. Carbs, with all the carbs. <sighs> Jacked. You know, I get you know, carbohydrates. Carb, oh, hydrate. Hydrate. Mark and I, every time we're in Florida, say we want to move to Florida. It's just such a vibe here. The trees, the palm trees, the greenery, the water. Like, you just cannot eat this. Vegas is great. Vegas is always going to be home. No, primary. Toronto is always going to be home. Yes, Vegas second. is secondary home, but like, look at this. Like, it's so nice. I don't know, something about Florida I just I love. My memory card keeps running out of battery, so I have to go back and delete everything off of it. But we're headed to the gym now. We are just drinking our pre-workouts as usual and enjoying this special little 
treats. I love these, they're so good. Um, it's just organic menstrual dates. And I'm having these as part of my high carb day today. Um, for the extra carbs for today, it's just been rice, um, rice and all my meals, and then I'm adding these as well. This is 30 grams of carbs for three of these days. And they honestly taste like candy. They're so good and so sweet. All natural. All natural. They just digest really easy. It's quick sugars. Um, and I, like I said before, I like to add fruit and natural stuff like that for carb ups just because I feel like it really helps move digestion along smoothly. And then we'll see um, tomorrow how things look and we'll kind of determine what we're going to do food wise and cardio wise based on how my body responds to today's carb up. And I know you guys are going to ask about the butter tarts and I did. I always order them to have them. I actually import them off Amazon and my mom and sis are coming so I'm sure they'll bring me some but I did bring some butter tarts and I have those waiting for me. Uh, but we decided not to use them just yet. We're going to wait until we are like right there like the night usually I have them like the night before the show and then the morning of the show and in between or backstage because it's just really easy to scoop out the filling and eat that and raisins and have to do backstage I'll probably just do dates because use the right two lanes to take the I4 East exit toward downtown I've been doing these so I've been loving these honestly it tastes so good and then we add a little bit of extra fats today too um, just with some coconut oil again for digestive purposes just to keep things moving along It's golden hour. It's a little bit late today, but that's okay. Perfect golden hour. Oh. How you feeling? I'm feeling great because I just took a scoop of pre HD black and it's starting to kick. <laughs> I love when the pre workout kicks in. I still have to drink mine. And I'm gonna enjoy this because I know soon we're gonna cut this out. When are we gonna stop? Um, like probably by after the, after Saturday tomorrow, right? Yeah, just Saturday will be your, tomorrow will be your last day. You know what's the worst is when you're used to taking pre workout um, and the pre HD black and pre HD elite. The pump with that formula is amazing. Crazy. And then when you don't take pre workout, it's Obviously part of it is placebo effect because you know you're not taking anything, but I can have like a coffee or sometimes I'll do the burn HG just for like energy wise caffeine. So I'm still getting the caffeine. It's the pump and the focus that is just ugh, it's missing so much, but it's okay. Anything at that point to be even like 1% better counts, especially when 1% can be the difference between, you know, first, second, fifth place. So we're going to cut out artificial sweeteners. Um, I actually haven't been drinking any energy drinks the last few days anyways. It's just been my pre-workout and we're going to cut that out after tomorrow. So Sunday is going to be a much, much needed rest day and just chill all day. Yeah, right now it's really just well, checking right now off the boxes. Yeah, right so. now is grind time still. Like, you know, we're grinding with the cardio, pushing AM, PM cardio. And today we're just checking in after every meal, posing couple times a day and the more that I check in the more that we go through posing so that helps too and then yeah Sunday hopefully we can just have a lazy day watch church online um, we can watch our fave Judd Wilhite Central Church our, online our pastor our pastor um, and, and we have a lot of um, the Netflix series ballers to catch up on yeah, we started watching Netflix series Ballers with uh, The Rock, and it's so good. We've been loving that, so I think Sunday is going to be, like, get our cardio Major done. Day. Get our cardio done in the morning. Usually Sunday is my full day off cardio, but since we're going to start to taper down Monday, I'll probably just still do cardio on Sunday, because before the show I stopped doing cardio. Um, but yeah, Sunday is going to be chill by the pool, sauna, church catch up on Netflix ballers and stay in bed with the blackout curtains closed. It's my favorite thing to do. 